A year ago at this time, LSU hadn't decided on a starting quarterback. Now it's crystal clear. Fifth-year senior Jaden Daniels is the man to lead this team entering 2023. Jaden's here because he's our starting quarterback and he does things the right way and he represents. And same thing with Makai and Josh. They're true representatives of how we do things on a day-to-day -day basis. It feels great, um, obviously going in and knowing that the stability, um, the continuity of the team, knowing that the team lo looks at me as the leader of the team um, and be able just to represent uh, LSU and then also some of my players out here, uh, the whole team out here today. It's a blessing to come out here and really uh, experience something like this with them. Some people may be surprised to learn that Jaden Daniels actually has the second best odds to win the Heisman Trophy this year behind Caleb Williams, the USC quarterback who took home the award last year. Daniel certainly has the athletic ability to make those kind of plays that indeed catch Heisman Trophy voters' attention. You're not going to be in competition for that unless the entire team does well. This is, I know, an individual award, but the individual that usually hosts that trophy is got one of the best, if not the best, team and offense in the country. So understand that, that he's got to rely on you know, the entire football team to excel. If I go out there and I help the team go one and know every week, I feel like we'll be in a good place. Daniel says he's packed on 15 pounds since last year and still has the speed. Now he must continue to push the ball down the field to LSU's weapons. I just want to give my guys a chance, you know, to go make plays with special players out there. Uh, with my league neighbors, Kyra Lacey and Brian Thomas, you know, once you get the ball in their hands, you know, they can make something happen. They could take a slant 80 yards or something like that. In Nashville at SEC Media Days, Jacques Doucet, WAFB 9 Sports.